Hi beautiful collective, welcome back. Thank you for being here guys. Some very awkward and draining energies have been coming out in the collective reads today. I do believe it's because of the full moon approaching in June, June the 3rd guys. Let's see. Someone who's been living a double life. Acting single when you're not around. Sneaky behavior. Could be hiding porn, a secret account, or lust browsing. Cheating is definitely going on. Online flirting, social media, or dating sites. Sneaky behavior. They're engaging in some risky behavior. Be sure to protect yourself to be safe. Cheating. It was a one-time mistake and now they're feeling regretful. They had a hookup with a professional. Could be with a prostitute, a stripper, or some form of professional arrangement. What's going on? And this person was trying to make you feel guilty when you don't give in to their desires. Okay. They're embellishing. They're trying to impress you or they were trying to impress someone else. Embellishing parts of their life to impress you. Woo. So this is dependent. Someone was codependent. It tried to come in reverse. Somebody's getting money from this. And they're covering up. Hidden in the closet. Some very serious addiction to prostitutes, gambling, or other expensive habits. Habitual cheating, more heartache in the future. So, look, I am telling you that someone is spying on you. They feel like they have settled for less. And they've been pillow talking, gossiping to these other energies about you. They like to have control. And when they don't get their way, this person turns argumentative. They are acting power hungry. And somebody has definitely been doing some sex witchcraft here. A friend is not just a friend. Mm. They're into some unusual preferences. They can have an interest or be engaging with something that is not considered mainstream. So they're both cheating on one another, guys. They've been engaging in some sneaky ass shit. So as well as the karmic energy... There is witchcraft involved. One of the people that they've been cheating with is into witchcraft, which is why it's always coming up in your reads. They're never where they say that they're going to be. So this karmic energy may be sneaking around on them. At least they're never where they say that they're supposed to be. Someone was using rich witchcraft to control a situation. So this karmic is into their own kinky thing. They are. No, spirit saying, no. Go right to the tarot. Clarify these. This, what do you want to know? Get money. They're paying a professional. Somebody is like codependent on them for finances. Yes, they are. It's this one. This is a engaging with someone who gets financial gain for... This is a professional. They're either a stripper, a dancer, or some kind of 
they're getting money for this sexual behavior. They are. No emotional involvement. So they're definitely manipulating. Something to do with, uh, could be a motel. Hmm. You're trusted your intuition. Oh, what's this? A double life. <laughs> you are protecting. Spirit is saying to protect your energy from this person because they are de definitely dealing with other lovers. And it could be multiple. Sex for money. I'm telling you. Trying to fulfill some kind of wish or something. Hmm. Hmm. multiple betrayals multiple options trying to kind of like live out some kind of fantasy this is mind games and manipulation Are you for real? Come on now. You walked away. Cheating. I'm telling you. <sighs> Paying for services. Okay. Yep. That's why they pushed you away. You're supposed to protect yourself because this person has been dealing with multiple stuff going on behind your back. There is engaging with prostitutes here or someone who is a professional. They could be a stripper or anyone in professional services, sexual professional services. They were living a double life on you. So they have a Hmm. 
engaging in risky behavior. Hmm. Someone's doing witchcraft here to paying to get witchcraft done, or they're doing it themselves. They may have had a one night stand with somebody. And they may have gotten someone pregnant. That's why they pushed you away. <laughs> Saying that they're just a friend. Hmm. Someone's been doing witchcraft on you. Hmm. Hmm. Multiples. Mm hmm. This person figured that they could calm things out with you that they could return whenever they wanted. They went toward these single when they weren't. This person, there's multiple people here, and I'm telling you, they hurt you. They did. Telling other people that they're single when there weren't. Saying you were just a friend when you were more than a friend. You were in a love relationship. Someone was definitely doing witchcraft. Some of the people here that they've been entertaining. You're in your higher self. You listened. And you were celebrating. Hmm. Huh. 
grass wasn't greener. They thought it was. Some shit's brewing. Hmm. Getting some kind of knowledge. You are definitely headed the right direction. I can tell you you're a lot happier without this person in your life. That's why. You actually could have started to feel sick being around this person. You're picking up on the succubus's energies that they've been dealing with. And there is a succubus here. There could have been a Libra doing magic on you or on this person. They didn't see something. There's multiples here. So things are coming full circle. Everybody's getting their karma. All these options missed out on a rare offer look there is multiple we got a pisces here we got a libra we have a gemini and we have a sagittarius aries leo energy you're going not for me i'm not dealing with your bullshit I want peace in my life. Uh, so somebody hypnotized somebody through messages. That's the divine truth. Now they're looking for a healer. They didn't know you were a warrior. You got the truth. You got the clarity. As above, so below is here. Ooh, devil energy. Dark attachments. I'm telling you, that's why spirits got you in solitude. Because it's almost like if they're engaging with low in vibrational entities, they're coming in having sex with you. You are picking up on those low vibrational entities. You could have started to feel sick. And they want to pull this off on you again. Guys, they want to pull off the same shit on you again. It's like they were leeching your energy, your vibrations coming back and forth, taking your beautiful positive energy and giving it to these multiple karmics who are feeding off of your energy. I cannot stand it. I cannot. I'm angry. I really am. I'm freaking angry. There's a group of karmics, okay? There's a group of karmics all effing the same people. I don't know if they were doing orgies. I don't know if they were doing same sex. I don't know what they're doing, but they're manipulating, lying, and cheating. And they were draining your energy, and they want to come back and do it again because they need a fix. Look out. I'm telling you. This is this frickin' emperor here with multiple sex partners. Okay? Leading a double life. They need their karma. And you are getting blessed. And this person is like, I'm telling you, they're getting greedy here, spirit saying, trying to like entrap you and sneak around on you and steal from you your resources, your energy and give it to these mother effers who don't even deserve to be in your presence. 
I'm sorry. It's the truth. They don't, they're not worthy to breathe the same air you breathe. Being in this energy. Because they were raping you of your energy. Of your divine light. And giving it to devil energy. You mother effers, I cannot. Fool. Manipulating. I don't care. Multiples. Screwing everybody else. Spying on you. Fuck sakes, I cannot stand these sick people. Multiple betrayals. I don't care what happens to them. They need their judgment. I'm sorry. Starting like arguments with you, provoking arguments with you, keeping you stuck. That's why they're getting their karma. I don't care what these people do. I have no inclination to give a crap what these people do but they were draining your energy they were draining your goodness your light and s blood sucking you to give it to other energies that's why spirit is saying they're under judgment and that's why they have to get their karma They're not trustworthy. Acting like they don't care. Acting reckless. This is like playing mind games with you. With an earth angel. That's why they're under judgment. Spirits like got them under judgment. You're too high ranking for this. I cannot. Some of these are in the closet, and I gotta be real. Some of these have a preference for the same sex, okay? They do. They do. Not all. You'll know if your person is or isn't in the closet. But I'm telling you, some of these are having sex with same sex. It's like they made a one-time a one mistake. No, they're lying. They may have had sex one time with the same sex, but they were doing other people. They were, come on. They didn't want you to know. <laughs> but I think the truth is being revealed. Hmm. Telling you. Paid lovers, pay for play. Now, I can make up an excuse here for your person and say they were under some kind of magic spell and that uh, they were for some of them, but if they were in high vibing energy, they wouldn't have fallen susceptible to these energies. So they were in low vibrational energy. They were, 
They were play for pay. Someone offered money for sex. And it could be sex with one of their friends. Okay? There's too many masculines here, guys. why spirit caused a tower <coughs> you cut this person off even though you loved him there could be some sexual illness so say this person No, I don't even want to talk about it. I just don't. I don't care what they do. They have dark attachments to them, but some of them are into kinky sex, and some of them are, like, in the closet, and some of them may have experimented with same-sex relationships, and it's almost as if Oh my God, what a freaking nightmare. So, <laughs> they got a friend that's more than a friend, okay? If you know what I mean, it is the same sex. They do both. For some of these, that's what's coming out in the reads. You will know, I'm not saying every person's person is out having same-sex relationships. This one was. Saying that this person was just a friend of theirs, but they were more than a friend. So they're doing feminines and they're doing masculines. Okay, they could be bisexual, but they're in the closet about it. And what it was doing to your energy was siphoning your energy from you and giving it to devil energy, dark attachments. So they would come in, you would feel these dark attachments. You would feel maybe you started getting nauseated. Maybe you started feeling sick. Maybe you started feeling exhausted. Maybe you started getting a lot of headaches. Your body was giving you clues. Something's not right here. Why am I so fucking tired all the time? It's because they were dealing with dark attachments. I don't care if they're masculines or feminines who they were doing. Some were doing both. I cannot. You know, I got no issue with being anybody's sexuality. But why hide in the closet? Why are you living a double life? Why are you pretending to be, oh, this is my empress, we have a family. It's like using the empress energy to hide who they truly are. That's what I got wrong with it. Hiding behind the skirt of the empress. Pretending they're in this family situation. Pretending that they're into um, the feminine energy while behind the scenes they're doing both. They used the Empress as a guise for the outer world. Don't freak out. 
that's not all your guys' people. Some of them were cheating with prostitutes. Some of them were cheating with having hookups at motels. And then some of them may have had a one night fling with the same sex or something like that or with a prostitute and it's like the it's being held over their head but that's why your energy was being drained i only care about you guys i don't really care about these people i'm sorry i don't it's all tools of the devil lies manipulation cheating narcissism blaming you stressing you out making you worry making you under anxiety like what do i do what's wrong with me what's going on not knowing anything that's why they're under judgment and whoever they hooked up with is a sneaky freaking link Okay, they are. And for some of you who's, you know, who your person is not like that, it's the sneaky link who is like that. And I think Sneaky Link tried to hook your person up in a threesome with the same-sex situation and could be blackmailing them with it. Sorry. I'm so sorry, guys. Nobody likes hearing this stuff. It's so disgusting. Be who you want to be if you're in the closet. Who cares? Stop using the Empress energies and other people's energy to hide your sexual identity or whatever using them as a cover a front i cannot i cannot deal with energies like that i cannot this is definitely sex for money And then coming to you for a healing. Sucking the lifeblood out of you. I cannot. And now these karmic energies are used to your energy. Because your person has lost their energy. Because spirit has taken away their energy. Like taken away their gifts. Taken away that. So who's, who are they after? The one who has it. You can get the hell away from my collective. I cannot stand this energy. I'm angry about this energy. I'm really angry. What a slap in the face that is. That's why Spirit is saying they deserve their karma. Okay? Some cases, it's the sneaky link. It is the karmic energy sneaking around doing this. Sex for pay. Infecting your person. Which then in turn comes back and infects you. person thinks they're a magician they do i'm saying that out loud your person thinks they're a magician they do they think that they can have anything they want when they want it they think they're an actual magician and prior to you they might have had they they could be a magician 
but they're losing their gifts because of the behaviors that they choose. This person is not using their gifts for good. They're not. They're becoming corrupt. <clears throat> they're corrupt. This person thinks that they can seduce anybody they want to seduce. And guess what? It's backfiring on them. Can't stand it. As far as I'm concerned, I don't care what their sexuality is. They're control freaks. Can't stand it. And then coming blaming you and putting you on the defense, twisting your words, making it look like it's your fault. That's why they're getting karma. They think they're a magician. So back in the day when you were with this person, no doubt they had some magician gifts. Like no doubt your person themselves might have been dabbling in magic, okay? They thought of themselves as a magician. And they may have been. But they're no match for a star seed, an earth angel, or an empress. And I think they've been stripped of their gifts. They're losing their magic touch. That's why they're getting karma. It's not so much as what they did is how they did it. It's not who they did, it's why they did it. Trying to afflict your energy, draining your beautiful light to feed demons is not cool with spirit. Take care.